You know what's funny? You know, I can look at it you like this, right? I don't like that. I, I'd rather bring you over here. Hold on. Let's start it like this. Can you see me? Let's see what this looks like. So you don't see me in there, right? Uh, they're on the radio right now, and they're talking about bringing back Montreal Expos and something about Arizona. So I'm not listening to the whole thing. So I'm only going to tell you everything around and in between because I do not know the rest. They're saying, what are we going to do? Why bring? I don't want that. It's got to be. And it's the way they're talking. They're not asking each other, well, what do you think? So now, oh, now they are. Okay. Now it's okay. So she said, what are we going to do from a 66,000 seat stadium? We're going to bring it down to 6,000 and play little league ball? 666 he just mentioned. You see, God's world is hockey. But on the female side, God likes to relax, you know. He needs to relax. He works a lot. And so do the women work a lot. They need to relax a lot more because they have seven days less. Or they have, the women just don't even have a, a whole month. The, the women, I, I mean, they get their period, but before they get their period, everything else starts to happen. The period is only what comes out. That's the dot of the eye. But you had to take the pencil out of your pen in order to mark the line. So before the period starts, mark off three days. Seven days of the period, mark off three more days. You got to say seven days. You got to be fair. Do you know why? We'll mark it even the, even the better way. We'll do it the way a chicken does it, okay? The chicken lays an egg six days a week. On the seventh day, she don't lay the egg, okay? So now I have to remember what I'm saying. So the woman, okay, those days that the chicken has the egg is 21 days with that egg inside of her before that egg comes out. So something is always growing. A woman is never sleeping, so we have to give her 13 days a month because there's 13 cards in the deck, and it took the 13 cards in the deck to create everything. The extra cards don't count because that's her spirit inside of it. That counts the 13 days. So the rest of the month, she has uh, 18 days uh, after that, when it all starts again. 18, 13, and some months it's less. And because of the month and the number in the month and whatever you do, whatever you've done the month before, uh, well, uh, it's all going to count in the next month's period on how it's going to affect you in your stomach and your groin. The woman's in pain. She's in pain from her period. Oh, she better think what she's done in the last six months because we cause it on ourselves. Yes, our bodies are not the perfect thing. We all know that. But for some reason, how come it's so perfect all the other days? The only time that gets aggravated is when you have your period, and some people are so lucky it only lasts them a couple of days. And because it's only a couple of days for so long, the time before thinking in the mind and the time after thinking in the mind is no longer there because they trust it now. I trust my period. By the time it comes, it's day three. It comes on day three, it leaves on day seven, and by day eight, it's, it's really away. So you got the four days. You got a four day and a three day week, and that's what life is all about four and three, because you can put one and then this one and then hop over this one and then hop over this one and hop over this one because God's all all he's all odd he's on the ball he's an odd ball <laughs> so um, what I'm going to talk about the Expos I saw, decided to do uh, a play so I made a play with the Expos so the short count for the play okay gives me 29 39 45 55 60 Totals, Expos totals 7-9. Seven, 7 times 9 is 63. That's the birth. 63, 1963, 1863. See, 1863 is no good because 19 had to bring the spirit into this world. There was no spirit of Christ in this world because Christ is left. Now next Christ is to come in on the spirit date, which is the 1900s. 63 because Urantia, okay, is in location of Trinity. The man the angel and the Holy Ghost, 21 each, because each one has an operation in the U. The U means the U-Haul, the element that we are in. It creates U's and it rewires itself back at the top, but in between it connects, so the wires are all cut off and reconnected, so they all end up making U's. At the bottom, it looks like hanging, things are hanging at the bottom like this. Like, uh, like the Egyptian plate, you know on his tea bag he has something hanging? Well that's the bottom of the connection, that's, the, that's actually in hell and it has to reconnect up above. So whatever you did falls down to hell, that information goes back up, it goes out to the system of Urantia, in through the system of God and back into you and God has tabs on us all the time. 
So Expo's count, okay, says 19 and 15 is 34, 44, 50, 60, 74, 79. Okay, we did that. Now, if we read Expo's backwards, it's like expose. And backwards, it's like S-O-P-X-E. S-O-P-X-E, the X stands for a box, so it's a soapbox. The Expo's is a soapbox. I mean, they had Woody Fryman. Wasn't he number 45? He was everything. Oh, I love that picture. I don't know why when I was younger. Oh, my God. Steve Rogers. I didn't know Coco the boy, but that name stood in my head forever because one of my friends down the street, his name was, I think, uh, Ricky, and he had a dog named Coco. And uh, he lived near the pass. And I was one, two, three. I was four away from the past, which makes it perfect. So Expos, if you take the letters together and use the E as the fifth letter, the X is the 24th, but we can say X or we can say six because X two plus four is six, so we can replace it with the F. The P is the 16th letter, which means the one spirit of man is actually the G, one and six is seven, so we'll use the G letter. Then you have the A, you use the one letter, then you have the S, which is the spirit letter. And when you add up the S, the 19th letter, and 1 and 9, all it equals is the 10. So what does 10 mean? It means the passage. It's the end letter. When it's the last letter, it's first. And that means it's first. Last is first. Last is first. So it has a different value. Last is first. Okay, so, but it's an S. The S equals 19. And 1 and 9 equals 10, which gives you a value of any one of a number of vowels. So if we use the expos and the letter count, we put it back together, it's E-F-G-A-I-E, -E, which means E-World of Business Man God and the Angel Birth in the E-World. It says, I'll show you in a second, I'll do it backwards. Fagay. Turn your mic on, Mark. Fagay. What does it mean in Jewish? There's got to be a shortened word for Jewish. And also at the end of F E G, like with February, okay, you have A I E. A I E says eight. A I E is eight because the G is right there in gay. You put the G in the middle or in the front of it because the G is silent. Eight is a silent G H, which is God of Heaven. Fi means the princess. The uh, the fe. What do you call it? The those those fairies that come from the sky. She's a fairy. That's what it says. She gave you life. Expos may return. Any baseball. God is hockey. Beta is baseball. You notice the way I missed some letters. The two letters I missed is A and Y, or Y and A goes. Yeah, man. See, I took it away because yeah, okay, means hockey or baseball because the capital Y. Okay, hold on a second. Okay. So you see what I did? Hockey, I put like that. Left side, right side, and the crossing is actually the two coaches. Now let's come together at the center point and play. Now when it comes to Beta, right, she starts on two. She starts on second base. Hold on a second. She starts on second base because Alpha starts on first. But then who's at the home plate and who's in the dugout? Well, seven, eight, nine. The keys under seven, eight, nine is the star key, the zero, and the pound key. They're not there for nothing. There's somebody at every single base because otherwise man couldn't come home. He has to walk the bases. The ball isn't even out there. The only ball that's out there on the field is in our minds. And we play the field of this diamond that goes around. And man goes around and around. And no matter how much information or how many runs he scores, because runs aren't enough. When it comes to money, you see it runs. They say, okay, I'll be nice to you with the runs. We scored 30 runs. We won't score anymore. But when it comes to money, money became the god. 
money became the god because there's more money now in in less hands than anything else it is overridden the spirit changing the formation inside urantia telling urantia man no longer runs by urantia rules they now run by spirit so once you fall under the under the 60 percent mark you're going to get pulled over by all these men. we're going to lose the world so everything must be corrected this is no joke I've been doing this for over seven years and in the last year it has been hot hot and fire I feel good about this whatever happens happens not my fault not my choice it's our choice and it's our fault we're all one we're on a baseball diamond the diamonds got four points if we can't cover the four corners of man okay by going on a sim simple field do you ever see them really fight in baseball don't you understand? They fight in hockey because God is fighting with the universe all the time. He made this world for everything to be at peace. Only games should be at war. And certain games you're not allowed to touch. And baseball's the diamond around the neck of beta and it goes in your necktie. When somebody dies, they cut the strands of the tie because they cut the strands of Durantia. It's a disconnection. The nine that you were born on, seven, eight, nine, and that's why, because they take the tie and they cut that part of the nine off. You're back into God's world in his house upstairs, and you're no longer running with Urantia rules. And Urantia rules are automatic. It must consistently balance who you are inside your head because of the whole system of the way it works. It's a balancing beam. It just balances and must balance. And if somebody does bad, I might get in trouble. If I'm too good and you're just medium bad, I might get your medium bad against me which I'll be happy about but we all reflect each other because the system must work without the system nothing is here and nothing exists we must make the system work now the reality of the situation is is this is what my reality is and your reality is you are on a screen you can put it on pause right now go over to the fridge take out a beer a glass of water Give a kiss to your wife on her head for saying, you know what, life's not all that bad. Maybe if we look at it the right way, maybe this kid is right. Maybe he knows what he's talking about. Maybe he thinks he knows. Maybe he wishes he knew. Maybe he doesn't know at all. Maybe he doesn't know at all. Exactly. I don't know at all. I know some. So, um, so baseball, there's supposed to be no fighting in the game. In hockey, there's a lot of fighting because everybody's fighting for creation. Because in this world, God makes creation and he has to work with everybody to create it. You see, the Urantia world, I told you, it's, it's a computer system and it's got laws and commandments in it. Okay, and in those commandments, it says many, 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 many things. But it's all narrowed down into the Ten Commandments of man because if man knew everything that he had to do, what good would this correctional center be? God put us in here to learn. Okay, so what did we learn? We learned that money is now more than the Spirit of God, which means the markets call for a day after tomorrow. Why a day after tomorrow? Because we can't go to tomorrow anymore. We don't have the one six spirit in line. We've now added the almighty dollar. It's a buck. B-U-C buck. 221. It even has the U in it. The U and the C in it. Two. 2123 creation C 26 the dollar is now made creation the buck so what happens Urantia has to readjust everything and come back the other way and inside our mind and try to correct it but now we've come to a time where it's too late to recorrect it because every so many thousands of years and now the Antarctica broke off this world must switch the axis just like a truck just like any machine you have, you have to change parts. Well, the part that's worn out on this world is that one piece that you don't see. It's a line that goes from the North Pole to the South Pole. It's worn out. Another one has to be pushed through. That needle has to come out, and a new needle has to come in. So when they pull one needle out and the other one, it passes the loop that holds us in the area we're in. And automatically, because of the pull, the magnetic pull, it automatically, bloop, the whole world turns around. And now man has to decide whether he's going to turn around of what he calls the spirit. Because we're coming into the last 225 years. It's the last cycle. But we never get to the 25. Because it's a punishment. We have to live at the last 25 to learn what's going to happen next. You see, beta starts on 2. And if there's 9 numbers on your telephone, okay, then you only have 8 years. 
And if it's eight, so we say from the one to the nine on the pool, they make two different, two different areas. One is striped, one is solid. So the day after tomorrow, okay, where the wolf came out, a wolf pack, a pack of cards. The wolves came out. They don't respect anybody. The wolves, okay, what you saw next was Wall Street. You basically saw Wall Street after that in New York City. They represented the movie with the wolves on Wall Street. When evil comes in into this last of days, at the beginning there was time for Moses and God to predict the commandments. But now that it's come to the end, new world order is demanded by one side, so new world order is demanded on two sides. Now it's fair. We all ask for it. But when God first came in and told Moses we're going to give him commandments, Moses never knew how many. But this time when the Ten Commandments come out, we all know how many. There are ten. And one is going to make it. And one was born. One was born from the nine birth for the Ten Commandments and the one spirit making eleven. So we have eleven, ten, nine. We have the planet Elenin bringing in the Word of God into this planet to be spread out all over the globe so we can save it before we turn around and turn upside down. So now, where was I? Yes. So the day after tomorrow and all these wolves, what you're thinking, you see, Rocky and Bull Winkle. Rocky is a moose, that's a bull. Then you have the Toro bull, and then you have the bear. Now how do we get all of these together? What's going to happen? Well, they're in the wrong place, first of all. So we have to change it all around. Um, we got three bulls, and we got pepper spray. Pepper spray? I wrote that down here, I don't know where it is. Pepper spray, <coughs> the eyes and the nose. You aggravate two of the most important things on your body, eyes and nose. Okay, those plagues, those ten plagues, you know what's fun about the end rather than the beginning? Because the minute we see somebody do something they shouldn't do, we know they called one of the plagues on. And in less than three days, that plague will come upon them. The same day with Moses. Did it take 40 days for the plagues? What was it? Four days for each plague? How did that work? Because will it be twice as long giving man time? Or is time too late? Because the Expos are coming back and they want to put him into Little League. Well, of course we should go into Little League. Man shouldn't be on the field. The field is for dreams. And we're on the field and we ain't dreaming too much. All we're out there is we're a bunch of wolves and we just want it all. What's it going to get us? We're just going to die in 225 years and the next cycle complete. You ain't got it anyways. The only families that ever keep it is only one family that I know. Well, there's a bunch of them, but one of them is the Queen of England. She still's got the money. She must have did something right. You can't screw somebody forever and not get screwed back. Don't you remember Scarface? He had all the money in the world until he acted like a fool. And then he lost it all. He lost his life. So what did he get out of it? What are we getting out of this? Why are we here? It's the correctional center, my friends. Don't you like the history of what we are so lucky? We are going to be here in the time of Aquarius when Aries opened up the skies and we passed through in a fishbowl. Aquarius, Aquarius. The vibrations of that song, the vibrations of all the la 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 such easy tunes to sing, the tongue just bounces off because the odd numbers sometimes sound easier to say than the even numbers. Oh, isn't that so easy to say? Oh, you can continue saying it, but if I say G, it's not an O. You say it all the time. Oh, 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 oh. But we're made of the exact same thing because our mouth that's open is the air we breathe, and that's the O in the air. It's the water in the air, and we lubricate ourselves and function to think. The O is also means the water, and the water is Aquarius. The air is a cellulaire. Everything has to do with some kind of air because we are heir to the throne. Because God will king somebody in the game of chess, chess in this world. He must king somebody in this world because he runs the outside world. If this planet is to continue, we need somebody in it to continue it. We need the Messiah to come now because God is into the last cycle of the formation of the man. Count at 25, one quarter of the six man or six islands of the one quarter of the other side of his brain of the six man to control the two sides. 
So that would be Trinity. Trinity would be, hold on a second. Let me mark this down. Give me a second. Trinity, one side of the line. So we got this one, this one, this one. Then we got this one, this one, this one. And this one goes to here, and this one goes to here. Okay. Three, six, seven. A, B, C, B, C, A. Here, where are you? Shin, shin. One side of your brain and the next. Three and three is six. And at the bottom is seven it meets, and that's your nose. And you knows what's got to be done. And that's the seventh letter your nose, the letter G in the piano. And as you see on the left where the C is, where the C, A, and B are, and that's how the piano starts. The piano starts right here. C, B, A. Uh, hold on a second. Let me mark it down so I can say it. C, B, A. F, A, B, C, D, A, B, C, D, A, B, C, 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 D, E, 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 F, D. Okay, here it is. I think it works this way. A, B, C, D, E, F. Okay. Now, I should have wrote, read it, I think, backwards. Okay. You have E in the center, and you have B in the center. E is the fifth, B is the second. That's 25. On the, on the reindeer of the quarter, it's marked 25 in between the reindeers. DEF is a dead, dead, death, deaf, dumb, and blind child. Shark plays a mean pinball, okay? Because on that side of your brain, okay, that's just the element of the computer. You see, you have the good side of your brain, ABC, and then you have the other side of your brain, DEF. Okay, now I could be wrong, but I don't think so. Well, because there, there's a lot of explanations the way. So DEF is on the other side of your brain. Okay, so now what happens, okay, is this. Okay, now this is what happens. It goes through your nose, and what I do is I support it on the bottom with a stand. See this diamond here? I mean, I'm going to do and show it. Don't worry, I'll show you again. Okay. Shin, shin. D-E-F, C-B-A. Now the shin would be D-E-F, and the sin would be C-A-B. Okay. Or... It's the opposite around. The DEF can go here and the other one goes here. I don't know which way it goes yet because I just started. Here would be the two and five passage. That makes the seven. Seventh letter is the G in piano. G in piano. Where does G go next? A, G, it goes to A. And then A to B to C to D to E to F. Back to G again. Now this is the thinking pattern. This is thinking. It comes to here. And man has to think between here and here. In the center here, it's both sides, because he's thinking of both sides. Then he's balancing on one side, balancing on the other side. So now you have, okay, you have this here. Hold on, I just want to mark something. Uh, 28 and 24. Now this here are the piano pedals. Da, da, da. And this one hits both sides, so it bah, doubles up. Eh? Da, you see, the, this is on the inside, this is on the inside this way, this is on the inside that way. Okay, I should be turning them around and turning them upside down here. It should go upside down. Okay, but it really doesn't make a difference because we're not talking. Now, in the piano, I, th I think, I think, I'm not sure, C, D, E, F, G. I'm not sure, is it... Does it go C, is it 28 or 29 on one side? You see, I have a little problem with this. If it's 29, the other side is 23. But irregardless, it's still 52, okay? 52 keys on the piano and 33 black is 88, plus the three pedals is 91. So you would just take out the deck of cards and you'll see what's going on. Anyways, they want to bring back the Expos, okay? I'm going to get a drink and I'll be back with you in a minute if you don't mind. Let's take a commercial break without taking a commercial at all. Oh, 
Okay, what are we going to do now? What are we going to do? 7 Up? You don't think Coca Cola, Pepsi, and 7 Up are included? A and W and root beer, cream soda, and everything else? It's so much fun. This is so much fun. I go to a grocery store and I say, hey, what's this at the grocery store? Oh, it's a pomme de terre. It's an apple of the earth. Or it's a pomplamousse. It's a moose. It's, a, it's an apple of a moose. It's an apple moose. That's what it is. Oh, my God. Apple moose. Pomplamousse. New York City. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Hold on, hold on a second. Pomplamousse. So... Pompe is palm, is an apple and a moose. It's a moose. It's it's a palm and a moose. A palm means an apple and a moose. And a moose is a bull. A moose is a bull. A male moose is a bull. And the bulls and the bears are in the markets in New York City. And a day after tomorrow is more than just the expression because inside that name, there's a calling of the same. Get some long underwear out, boys. This may be true. Right now, it's just a story I'm writing in my book, but I'm trying to predict the future or create the future inside the mind. I think they call that science fiction, okay? But when I tell you what I tell you, when I tell something, I tell. I just don't say if, ands, or but. I tell you what I believe. Hypothesis, general proposition, whichever proposition it is, a day after tomorrow, might not mean the freeze. The only thing it might freeze is your wallet. Because they already had a day after tomorrow, part one, is when they cut the bonds. You see, the calling, okay, of Gadal is not coming from the good. It's coming from the evil, because the evil have a stronger voice. Although we are many, we're not heard. The only time we are heard is by God, and God only knows to come when the opposition starts to squeal in the pig pen like all the other pigs. E, E, E. E is E world is spree. It's the E world. E and E is 55. It's the passage. When you call five of five, five of five is the passage. It's 25. It's Jack. Five times five is 25. It's Jack. Times five is 125. It's one spirit of Jack. Times five is 625. And you have the man count. Now, how did we get there? With the man count of that 625, well, it's pretty simple. The egg that came into the universe, okay, because the O, okay, is the first letter of creation. That's a vowel. The Z is the last of creation of creation. They're both even numbers. One's a six, one's an eight. One means man, one means heaven. Total count of the two of the center of the alphabet and the end of the alphabet is 41. If you multiply that 41, by, two, by, by that 625, you get 25,625 the man count. Now, if you want the short count, it gets a little confusing, but I'll shoot it out at you. Ten commandments of ten, right? Ten plus ten is twenty, because it's a double up world. Two, four, six, eight, who can we appreciate? So ten to twenty, to forty, to eighty, to one sixty. One sixty is one spirit of man. The three twenty, okay, that's the creation of beta. It's an expression after the fact. And the creation of Beta is you and me. Because Beta was created already, but she recreated one like her. But she's a computer and we're not. So it's 32. So we have uh, 120 to 640. And I think that's 640 pixels. And 640 goes to 1280. And that's 1280 pixels. And 1280, okay, is the most they go. So if it's the most they go, the next level will tell you something about a new beginning. So the next level from 1260, uh, from 1280 is 2560, 2560. But the zero means, because it's an open zero and you see the back of the background and you just see your pen mark marking the zero, the zero means something. What is the zero all about? It's about man, six, and the earth, six. So that zero has to have a six, okay? So it would be 25, okay, that's zero, represents the six, sorry, and the six is just before it. Now, what does the zero mean? Well, in Christ, this is what the zero means. Everybody goes out hunting, don't they? There's only one quarter left. See, man is like this. Okay, one quarter of six 
of one quarter. 25, 6, 25. That's the way it works. 25, 6, 25. 2, 5, 6 of 6, 2, 5. 25, 6, 26. It's an expression re-expressing themselves because when you read the Bible and you read the Torah, they're always going forward. They go backwards. They go forward again. They go all the way down the line. They go all the way back again. They turn from this page to that page, from that page to this page. And we're trying to figure out how come we can't figure out anything. Because there has to be an explanation of everything and sometimes there's more than one explanation. So we go back and read the same page again. Because the meaning has changed because we've gone to a new area. The moose, a representation of a bull, but not a toro, because the toro is something of the day after tomorrow. Toro, Toronto, tomorrow. What will the bull develop? The field has now been laid out. The first plague is coming on in, and I didn't call it. We can't call the plagues because we're good. Only the bad people can call all the plagues because they're going to call all the calls. The pitcher and the catcher. P and C. Catcher in the rye. R Y E. Angel residence split in the E world. In the rye. The plague comes with you guys, man. You've got to straighten out this whole world because we're not going to survive. If we do not overcome the red devil, the money, and put the money under us and saying, God gave us money into this world to pay for the difference, not to create the difference. And now it's created the difference. When you spray pepper into somebody's face, why don't you come to Quebec with pepper? Do you know what kind of fights we had in Quebec with pepper and the Englishman? You're a pepper, you're a pepper, everyone's a Dr. Pepper. Everyone knows everything, you're all doctors. D is the angle of God, R is the angel resident. D, A, R, it says to dare. D is the angle, D, and R is A, R. The letter R has, a, has an angel just in front of it. So if you're gonna to start to play with pepper against the young and the innocent who are trying to express themselves, the only reason they're there is because no one's listening because they wouldn't have stayed there that long. It took them that long to get there. They waited to get there until it was right. Now that it's right, they want it to be corrected. Because why should they leave? They pay their tax, let them sit on the street. They, why, why, hold on, aren't there laws we shouldn't sleep on the street? But they let them sleep on the street anyways, the bums. But when they come to Wall Street and they want to go on the street, now they come to bother them and they haven't done a thing. The lamb is angry. The wolf is hungry and he buzzed around the last time in the day after tomorrow and he went all over the place and for some reason he never caught the guy and he should have the wolf and the fox have you ever heard of 1945 have you ever heard of the great depression has anybody ever heard of great britain in 1914 and the disgusting shit that went on you see whatever went on on the interior right is now going on in the exterior and we're expressing it thank god it's not 1914 or the two armies would come and take us away eventually they will take us away because you're harming the money the money hurts i never knew money hurts it's not even in the poem sticks and stones may break my bones but names will never harm me i never saw money in there Money is for nothing, and the M, TV, M means to love in French. M A, M A, M N A. The TV is us. We're the visual. We're live TV. We conversate with each other. We express with each other. But if you take away the connection from the world, no one's going to have any money to pay any more of anything, and no one's going to have anything. And whoever doesn't have a garden or a friend, you're in big trouble. This is Aquarius, my friends. This is not any time of the year. This is the time that whoever was born in the last hundred years is going to be see the, the, the miracle that we've been waiting for for over 4,000 years since Mo uh, Noah. In fact, t t Noah is, Noah is 2350, the 37, 3670. Is it 3670? And then that would be 1320. 
Is it 30, 3760? I think it's 3760, which would make 1420, and then 2000 years, and make 3420, and then 2014 is 3434. Oh my God, that's insane. I'm going to explain to you what I just did. Since the time of Moses, okay, starting at 2350. At 3760, Jesus came in, 1,420 years, right? Reverse that, it's 2014. We get to the year 2000, makes 3,420 years that have passed. 34, now we add the year 2000, we go to 2014 in my prediction, we get 34, 34. No matter how you look at it, it's 77 and the calling of Gadol arrives. Don't you think that one day things will get straightened out and whoever owns this house is real? Because we don't see the general manager and I don't see Bill Gates and I never saw Steve Jobs, does that mean they're not real? Because they did all their stuff from the interior and did it so well, they didn't have to show their face. When you start messing up, you start to have to show your face. Unless you want to come out there with love and do the commercials yourself, it's a different story. You do one commercial, you see a million people. You spend a few bucks of what they gave you, you give them, and they see your face. Hey guys, what's happening? Is there a lettuce in the crowd? A lettuce? Yes, we want to know if you're going to let us in because time is up. Aquarius shuts the door. The Expos might come back but on the radio we don't want little league well that's what we deserve is the little league why can't we enjoy the little league don't you enjoy the cartoons don't you enjoy santa claus and easter and the bunny rabbit you like going out to the shopping center it's your business it's almost like a business going out shopping and that's why all these people go down to the dollar store and everybody says they're addicted no they're in their business they're in their own zone they can make their own choice that's what everybody wants well now this whole world has to be treated like a child so we bring back the expo so we can go back to our childhood. Canada is so connected, it's insane. It's just insane. And Baffin Islands, Val d'Or, Fort Chimo, and Gava Bay. Oh my God. Oh, I love those. I was spent time there. Seven Islands, Set Il, all the connections to everything. So let's see if we can finish off the piano. Okay. The word piano has 88 keys in it, okay, and the three stepping stools. Man's nose is right here because he hits all the keys, he stamps his foot, what's going on, he stamps his foot, what's going on, he leans up against the wall, and he figures out the vibrations go to here, and then after the vibrations go to here, okay, It goes all the way back to the top and it starts over again until everything is corrected. And that creates the heart and it creates the ears of a bear. Yes, it creates the ear of a bear. When you go from halfway through the composition uh, equation, it creates the bear. When you go from the bottom to the top, it creates something else. It depends what world you're in. I'm going to see if I have anything else to say. So you saw what that is. Let me show it again. Three and four, seven. Four and three, seven. Three and four, seven. Four and three, seven. Three and four, seven plus three is the Ten Commandments. Dash four. Let me mark it down and show you. Three plus four plus three equals ten. Dash four. CB code ten four one zero four. There is a war. There is a war. Why do we think there's a war? Y2K has come back. Y equals 2 minus K. K is the king. Ace. You play, you play Casino War, you start at 2, the ace is used here. So what does the Y equal? It equals the ace. 21, 23. Creation. 2 plus 13 is 15. 1 is 16. And 1 is 7. This answer here comes out to seven. These answers came out to seven. We have 777 for the first time ever on a CB code of 10-4. And like I said, the creation of man is 36. 
So he's born in October 4th, 1963, and 104, or the year 14, 20, 14. They always come around together. If you draw them close together, all the numbers will connect because it's Trinity. No number is supposed to be further away than one, okay? In, in the complete equation I'm talking about. You can go first to second. If it's more than, than one, you have to find the middle. If it's away from two, you do the equation that way. And you keep playing with it and playing with it and playing with it until you come up with something. Um, what else did I have? Oh my God. Oh boy. Not this one. I had another formation of the uh, piano. And they said to Noah, Line them up two by two. Line them up two by two. Two by two. Two by two. Do you understand? Scooby dooby doo. Where are you? Two by two or two b two, which equals to two twenty two. So what happens here is what I'm going to show you is all my letters are set up two by two except for passages. Okay. 2 by 2. B is the second letter. It's a buy letter. You're buying the B. Don't forget when you play Baccarat, you, when you play craps, you can buy you can buy you can buy the 4 and the 10, right? You buy the 4 and the 10. Okay, that's 10 4. You buy. You end up with 2 2 2 or 2 2 2. Now, how many sections do we have? 1 2 3 4 Five, and, and I think six, and, now, and how many single ones? Seven, eight. Eight times two twenty-two, seventeen seventy-six. This is this is all based on the piano. This, okay. So after we did that, I have the fire energy, okay. Which this is the this is the fox. This is your brain. It's on fire. Here's one end of an ear, here's another end of the ear. It goes all the way around to his nose. He crisscrosses here. And it's in his brain. It just goes around and around the information. And he has to decide what's going to happen next. That's why it's fi fire energy. Five. F-I-V-E. Five. The five is a joker. I mean, he's just a joker just like that because he's a fag. Because when you say five, F-I-V-E, when you have to say fourth street, can you say fifth, five, five, I can't even say it. Try and say five streets, five streets, five streets. I can't say it. But now, instead of saying streets, say uh, if. Can you say fifth? You're not saying the V anymore. You've changed the V for an F. And five is that number and then after five the 60. Now when you finish 60 in French you get the 70 you say 60 again you count up to 60 in French and you get the 70 and you say 60 because you in French you have to say 60 plus 10 soixante aids this and the word aids this in between okay is the 25 number et is the fifth letter of the alphabet and the t is 25 again the 25 of jack of man's life fifth so we had uh, the T and the E, the E-T. So now what was I talking about? Try and remind me. If I don't come back to this, mark it up so we can see what it is. Um, yeah, so, so fifth, uh, 60, that's what it is. Thanks very much. I appreciate it. Um, so 60 is repeated again into 70. You see, in English, we say 70. But in French, they say 60 plus 10. Soixante, A. This et this, but this if you really say it and look at it, it's different because it, it could be dit which means to say, or dis to dislike. So you have sixty. So you have soixante this, okay, which is the first one. Now you start soixante a owns eleven, okay, soixante owns, okay, and when you go down to uh, a ninety, they say eighty plus 10 again but you we always start because the first year okay is an opening year everything goes inside that opening the year actually starts at the one okay so you say 11 
So what is 1111? Well, 60 owns, 880 owns, 91, okay, and 61. One is the spirit and the other one's the one spirit of man. 91 and 61, which is 16 and 19 on, on the roulette, one above the other, totaling 35. 3 and 5 is 8, 3 times 5 is 15, you total them up, you got 23, 23 is beta creation. So you got 91, the 91st day of the year. <laughs> is April 1st. But every fourth year they jump over the lamb, I guess. April 1st is the 91st day of the year. 31 in January, 28 in February, you got a total of 59. March 31, 59, 69, 79, 89, 90. And then you got April 1st, 91. And the seventh would be uh, 97. Oh my God, my sister. Yeah, so you have that. So you have 60 and 90, and 90 are very special. And you go all the way up to 99. So you go from 61 to 99, which would be a total of 38. And that would be the three sectors of the heaven uh, that our mind must pass through while it goes. See, we don't see it because we're on the outside of our head. But if you really relax and go into a deep uh, meditation, you can get into the middle of your mind. Instead of having to look out through the eyes, you look out into your own eyes and you stop the other eyes from looking. Or you tell the computer, keep one eye open for me, I'll look inside mine. So the king, the jack, and the jack both have one eye each. You need one eye for the outside, one eye for the inside. So we have two eyes to see, but we're actually seen only with one. And the eye we're actually seeing with is our mind. It's in between of what we're thinking, of what we see. Otherwise, we don't have to see it all. We see it, and now we know something. So we're going to think about something. Oh, look at that. It's an orange juice. You know. Another thing is the orange peel okay, is the protector of the sun. It's all white on the inside, and it has a core that goes right through from one end to the other end. But in the center, I think inside the orange is an apple. The apple core. God used the orange type style, uh, but he shoved an apple in the orange and then he called it the sun. He made a bunch of pokey holes in it to make sure we couldn't see it properly. And the sun is the son of God. He's right up there. And a Lenin passed by and nobody told you, but a Lenin, everybody forgot to tell you, they told you about what happened to the tail when he Lenin left. Well, the tail, my friend, started on the other side of the on the other side of the sun where mercury and venus met the lenin first we didn't get to that position yet we got to where lenin left but the biggest pull okay comes from what trails and it'll take three months for the constant pull to come in uh in about february 14th in which will be the valentine's day in this era but i think valentine's day in the next era is going to be february 7th and Independence Day is going to end up to be on the 13th of July in the New World. Why? Because there's going to be a Messiah, and you must honor the Messiah by giving him a day in the honor of man. And that would be on the seventh day. You see, this, this Valentine's Day is in honor of the machine. Okay, it's on the 14th, 1 and 4 is 5, it's a neutralization machine. So the next one comes in and we count all the cards in the deck now because we have someone in the house that has a full deck. So now he's going to use all the cards in the coming of the new world, the coming of Gadal, in the world of Urantia, in the house of Hashem, under the star of David, in the world of Goliath. I praise you all. Send my words. I don't care if it's a priest, and I don't care if it's an Allah. I don't care. The word care means to care. It means send it out to whoever you wish. Just care with me, and let us move on so we can rid ourselves of the Toros in everybody's alley. Toro, and tomorrow I will see you again. I am Raphael of the NGC Nebula. 7286 in the constellation of Pegasus. May she come down to the Suez Canal because Suez backwards is actually Zeus. And if you don't think these gods live, they do live. What they're actually doing is they're monitoring all the weak spirits and all the good spirits. They have their own house. They must watch every piece of the elements that created man. And they're all in your alphabet and the answers in your mind. Let us praise and go forward before the time comes of the change of hands as the last of all days is on the Rosh Hashanah of 2014 and how perfect that it ends between the 3rd and 4th of October because on the 5th 
the Mayans say, those are the unlucky days. But on the 5th and 6th, when you come back, we're back into 360 days a year because it's 365 days a year by the Mayan uh, 360 days the Mayan calendar, but our year is 365 days. So I think the Indian and Mayan calendar is going to be infiltrated into our world, and in 2016, it's going to say 001, the introductory of the new conscious mind of one and all good men together, and I bless you all.